The CUNY J School received great news as the Mayor's Office of Media and Entertainment has granted them $1 million towards the Center for Community and Ethnic Media. The program has been running successfully at this school since 2012. The program is geared to assisting journalists from different cultural backgrounds and providing the tools they need to stay current in today's growing digital age. Commissioner Julie Menon was there to make the announcement. So we know how important the community and ethnic newspapers are to New York City and to readers. In fact, the 4.5 million New Yorkers who are reading community and ethnic newspapers. So at the Mayor's Office of Media and Entertainment, we really want to be able to support these publications and that's exactly what we're doing today. Rong Chow is one of the many journalists who will be able to benefit from the new program. Yeah, uh, I am a print uh, reporter for sure, but these days a print reporter has to do all sorts of things, you know, video, audio and things, uh, but we don't often have that training. Uh, and when I was at school, I was trained as a print reporter, so the scenario kind of like scared me. And um, indeed, my boss did ask me to do some video a few months ago. I was like, no, I, I don't know how to do it. So the grant and the workshops comes from it um, is really, like timely help to us. We serve the, the city of New York and the people who live and work here and it's the capital of the media world and so we want to make sure that when we're training people that we're training people from all walks of life and all different communities and uh, it should be open and accessible to as many people as possible so it just seemed like a natural extension of our work given how important the community and ethnic media outlets are to the city. Uh, empowering this media means empowering these communities. Uh, empowering this media means uh, you are uh, uh, making it uh, like the transition of people and their engagement, their civic engagement, their political engagement. You are speeding it up and you're facilitating it. In recognition of the city's support, the J School will rename its broadcast facility the Made in New York Broadcast Center, but will continue with the same dedication and zeal for molding today's brightest journalist. Classes are scheduled to start sometime this year and they want to hear from you. If you have any suggestions or want to take part in the classes, you can reach out to the email below. For BronxNet, I'm Veronica Guiti.